For today, I'm back on Fortnite, and this time with the RTX 2070. So I've done a video with this card already in Fortnite, but I want to go back and test it in DX11, and disable Nanites as well as Lumen. And yeah, we'll start it up at 1080p at the Epic preset. And here we are with that. There we go. So I've gone ahead and played the game already, because normally on your first game, the game is very stuttery and very choppy. So I normally go ahead and play a game or two to make it smoother, and then I'll start recording. Here we go. First game on. I guess first game as I'm recording. And yeah, so far in the 70s and the 80s. It's not too bad. The stuttering though is still here. This game is just, I don't know how people play it. Because it stutters for quite a bit. And every single update and season, the game just resets. The game will stutter for four or five games and then it becomes playable again. Oh, he's tanky. I'm out. It is just not good. Let's go. I've had enough. Yeah, they're all bots. Dude, they're after me. Look at this. Leave me alone. Please. Somebody's shooting over here as well. And yeah, so far guys, again, a stable 80 and with dips into the 70s and boost up into the 90s. It's pretty good to be honest, not too bad. Man, the scoping time is pretty slow in this thing. What is this? It's a bolt action. Killed one of them. Okay, are these bots? <laughs> I, think, <laughs> I think they are bots. Second guy's dead. Third guy over here. I can't even see him. This gun's crazy. But you know how it is. The first game on, half the lobby are just bots. But you know, it feels good. It's free kills, it feels good. I won't, I won't be complaining about this. But they are spectating me. Hmm. Don't know if bots can spectate, but I wouldn't be surprised if they could. Okay, now for the stutters, guys, in DX11, it's not too bad now, actually. It only took one game, and it's mostly smooth now. I feel like with DX12, it takes a couple of games at least. Oop. This guy's over here. Hello there. I mean, that guy could be real. I don't know. He was running away. But yeah, so far, guys, it feels fine. The game is playable, and the aiming feels fine as well. It's definitely usable. And for the graphics, it's pretty good, but I do see a lot of popping, which I'm not a huge fan of. Let's pause it here, enable DLSS, see what we can do with that. DLSS, we've got to go down. Uh, these settings have changed. I don't like how it looks. Uh, but yeah, DLSS, and let's use the quality preset, apply it. And yeah, so far in the 120s and the 130s, that is fantastic. And for the graphics, identical. It is as sharp as before. I can't see any weirdness going on with the graphics. There's no blurriness. It looks great. And now you compare this to Warzone, and it looks awful in Warzone. It's blurry. I d oh, man. Don't get me started on Warzone. It is just not even usable. But yeah, in Fortnite, it's definitely usable. Looks really good. And FPS-wise, fantastic. So we gained, what, like 40 to 50 FPS on average? Oh, the rock blocked it. That's his fault. And the game is still stuttering, unfortunately. That was uh, an awful fight, but I'm pretty sure he's a bot. He missed so many shots. Or maybe he's playing on the Switch at 20 FPS and using Joy-Cons. Whoa, 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 hello. That was a good hit. Boom, another hit. He's... Just He's scared. Running away. Let's kill him, teammate. Yeah, let's kill him. Let's go. Who is this guy over here? Oh, it's a turret. Okay, what's this skin, man? What's this skin, dude? What's happening? <laughs> There's an AI. An actual AI. With uh, a fake AI. He's trying to be a human. I mean, he had an actual name, though. I don't know. I'm so confused. I don't know what's a bot anymore. Not a fan of my guns, to be honest. A grappled blade. Um, yeah, give me this instead. Okay, let's pause it here. I want to push DLSS a bit further and see how it looks then. Because so far, again, it's identical to before. So let's pause it here, head back to DLSS, and push it down to balanced. 
Okay, FPS wise, so far, it's pretty similar in the 130s still, in the 120s. And for the graphics, it's still pretty good to be honest. It's not too bad. It's definitely far more obvious in the distance with the, with the grass over there. It's far more blurry. But overall, it is pretty decent still. But I think for 1080p, I would use the quality preset instead. Alright. Oh, this gun sounds nice. See, I'm doing good in the first game, but if I restart, I'm going to get trashed on. What is he doing? We are almost in the top 20. If this first game is a win, hey, that's a good way to start it. And yeah, the aiming guys, amazing. It feels fantastic. The stutters are still here, unfortunately, but it's happening like every minute or so. So not super common, but yeah, hopefully it does go away after... A couple of games. That's normally how it works anyway. Oh, hello. Yeah, that's a bot. For sure. This guy's also a bot, for sure. Who just shot me? Yeah, see up top. Alright. Here we go. I'm being chased. Ooh, that was an actual player, and he got cooked. This guy's driving a car. I could try and kill him, right? Should I just try and kill him? He's going to drive his car again. Yeah, that's right. I'm going to go, um, like, over here. The guy up there in his car, just being a little rat, just like me. Okay. That's a bot, if I've ever seen one. There we go. He's dead. Alright, top two guys. There's one guy left. And he's over there. He's driving his car again. Boom! There it is. I think most of the lobby were just bots, but... We had a couple of actual people playing it, so it's alright. It's whatever. It played well, guys. Towards the end, felt no stutters pretty much. Um, and yeah, FPS-wise, that's fantastic. The LSS looks great. Let's back out, play at 440p, come back in. 440p, same settings with no DLSS. So far, this looks amazing. Super sharp, super crisp. I love it. Alright, let's queue up. I'm going to get absolutely trashed on now. Since I believe this game has skill-based, just like COD. So first game was a win, second game I want to die immediately. Alright, second game, and yeah guys, so far it looks incredible. I can see so much further ahead. And that's the main benefit of playing at a higher resolution. It's easier to see enemies and objects in a distance. I guess it's more clear. And yeah, so far in the sky, 60 FPS. Pretty good so far to be honest. This card is pretty old, from what, 2018 I think? So it's doing a good job. Leave me alone! I'm in the wrong house, sorry. I'm gonna leave, dude, please. Yeah, it does fall down below 60 FPS, quite easily, actually. And for a fast-paced shooter like this, not ideal. And yeah, to be honest, guys, at 60 FPS, the aiming isn't amazing. I mean, I don't know. It's not as consistent, it feels like, versus before. Last game, we had, what, like 80 FPS on average, and that felt way better. At 60, it is sluggish at times. Let's pause it here, guys. Enable DLSS again, and see what we can do. I'll begin at the balance preset, and we can go down even further later. Alright, balance DLSS, and so far, wow, in the 90s and the 100s. The aiming feels amazing now. Super responsive, super quick, feels great. And the graphics, hmm, not as sharp as native. It's a bit softer, but just slightly. So it looks fantastic still, but again, a bit softer than before. This game is really quiet. I've got zero kills this entire time. Can't see anyone. All right, lastly, let's pause it again. Push this down to performance mode. Wrong way again. How? And where are the arrows? At performance mode, it does look pretty good, but the car in motion is looking pretty bad, actually. I can see some motion blur trailing behind the car itself, and, uh, and the sharpness just isn't there.
but everything that's static looks great. And FPS wise, I mean, about the same. It's not much higher to be honest. What's up, bud? What is he doing? He was shook that he even saw me. Okay, I think that's about it, guys. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys next time. Next video. See you guys there.